All right, guys, so today we got our first look at the skin that's going to be in book two, chapter eight. And what I mean by that is the bot, the actual bot that's going to be chasing us around the map as we try and complete it, try to escape the boat and try to, you know, get all the secrets. This is the new bot right here. Now, I know this looks absolutely terrifying. I think this is probably the scariest uh, piggy that we've seen so far in the game. And there's actually a lot going on here. I actually have a few questions I want to bring up about this skin, too. But first, let's talk about the update. Now, unfortunately, there's two pieces of bad news about the update number one you're not subscribed yet about half of you guys aren't subscribed to my channel so if you're not yet subscribed do me a favor hit that subscribe button right now the other bad part uh the other bad news is that unfortunately the update is getting delayed so honestly piggy book two chapter eight has been a little bit of a wild ride i, I think a lot of people were expecting it to come out two weeks after chapter seven which would have been this past weekend but instead you know we got a little small update in place of it and then the projected release date for this new chapter was going to be this weekend now unfortunately minitune has been sick of the past few days actually honestly about the past week he said on twitter that he's had some migraines he's had some uh you know general sickness and he hasn't been able to work on the update and get it up to par to the level the level of quality that i really wanted to be at and so unfortunately he's going to delay the update until i'm guessing next week no honestly this is okay obviously minitune's uh health comes first this is perfectly fine i'd much rather have a awesome chapter without any bugs with a full story with you know all the bells and whistles even if it does take a few more days to get it that's perfectly fine with me i do hope though that mini tunes feeling a lot better and hopefully uh hopefully we get this chapter next week i think that'd be pretty cool and actually on that topic i i look i i, I know i every, every time something like this happens whether it's piggy whether it's a different roblox game everyone gets really upset about it and i understand a lot of people are you know younger so they may not completely understand someone tweeted mini tune and said mini tune i used to like you as a developer and I used to have faith in you. In the recent days, it seems to me as if you didn't care about the whole game and the community delaying updates has become your normal routine and your game is suffering. Due to this, Minitune, please wake up. Now, I'm not going to show the person's name. I, I you know, I, I don't want anyone to send hate that way or anything, but like, look, 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 look. You know, as a, as a YouTuber who doesn't get a lot of sleep, I get about four to five hours every night and I, I, I can promise you Minitune probably gets a lot less than that a, a lot of the time. I, you know, if he needs a break, let him have a break, man. There's a lot of really serious health issues that can arise uh, if, if you're not, you know, being healthy, if you're not getting up, if you're not eating enough, if you're too stressed out. Like Minitune mentioned, he was losing hair before because he was so stressed out about the updates. And it's a stressful thing because, you know, you want the updates to be cool. You want the new maps to be cool. If they're not, then everyone's going to get mad at you. They're going to scream at you. It's 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 not good. So, you know, like like this person, obviously, I they're, they're probably really young. Um, they probably don't fully understand the full picture here, but look, uh, if Minitune ever sees this, uh, let's give him some love down in the comments, all right? Give, give Minitune some love down in the comments. Now, with that out of the way, let's talk about this new skin. So here it is right here. I showed it off a little bit earlier. It, it It's it's pretty scary. It, it's a mummy piggy. We haven't seen a mummy piggy yet, and it literally has Freddy Krueger claws. It looks exactly like Freddy Krueger, or actually, may, maybe her, maybe, <laughs> I don't want to maybe, maybe look a little bit like her. I wonder where Minitune got the idea for this from. I wonder, I wonder. I wonder where. Maybe he should just add her in the game. You know, maybe he should just make a whole chapter with just her. I, okay, enough simping. Anyway, yes, this is going to be the bot. This is going to be the thing chasing us around the ship in chapter eight. And honestly, it's really, it's, it's kind of strange because I, I think we all kind of assumed that Budgie was a pirate and this was a pirate ship. And why in the world would a pirate ship have a mummy on it? That doesn't really make a lot of sense. I guess seeing this mummy piggy now, it would make more sense that this ship is actually maybe a transport vessel, a transport ship. Maybe they're transporting mummies from like, a museum or, or a gallery or something to another one across the ocean maybe may, may, that makes a little bit more sense now here's the really weird thing about this piggy skin now we we do have piggy skins similar to this in the game we've got dino piggy you know that's in the game we've got some really weird skins like piracy that's in the game however skins like dino piggy aren't actually canon they're just fun skins that are in the game they don't actually have anything to do with the actual story of piggy this is the bot which means that well it, it's it's going to be part of the story now, if you look at the bots that are already in the game, they've all have, you know, a pretty realistic feel. They feel very grounded in reality. Nothing too crazy. Like the pig has a baseball bat, right? The robot has a chainsaw arm. The soldier with the flamethrower. He's got a flamethrower. You know, it's all pretty grounded in reality. This, though, this is a pig wrapped in a mummy outfit with giant 
claws coming out of his arm, giant claws coming out of his feet. This is not the normal pig. This is most certainly not a pig that has just died and come back to life as a piggy. And we can even tell because if you look closely at the eye, you can even see like some black goo dripping down from us some black goo just coming out of his eye right there and then of course on his arm it looks like he's been restrained like that's a bracelet like maybe he was restrained down you know like like handcuffs almost so my question is is this going to be our first supernatural piggy bot like the, our, our first actual supernatural canon you know skin that's that's actually in the game character wise in the game we've had a lot of supernatural uh skins in the game that aren't canon but this could be our actual first canon super supernatural skin because as far as I know I don't know any pigs that have super long claws like that so maybe this has something to do with the insolence maybe the insolence has like attached itself to him maybe this weird shadow goo in his eye has something to do with the insolence maybe he's like this weird like otherworldly shadow creature or something like that these are all pretty big possibilities and honestly I'm pretty excited to find out leave your theories down below though what do you think is going on with this I don't even know what to call it I mean it's obviously a pig you can see the pig nose but I, I don't know what in the world's going on with it? The mummy? The mummy pig? What do you think is going on with it? Let me know down below. And of course, show some love for Minitune down in the comments as well. Keep using Star Code Real Creep whenever you're buying Robux and Roblox Premium. It helps me out a lot. I really do appreciate it. It allows me to, uh, to do a bunch of Robux giveaways for you guys every day on live streams. And of course, subscribe if you guys have not yet. Over half of you guys are not yet subscribed. So make sure you subscribe. I'll see you guys later today for a brand new live stream. All right. See you guys there. Bye.